The National Bank of Poland likes to gradually adjust interest rate by making several minor reductions instead of one big one, according to the bank's governor. Adam Glapiński spoke to the press on Thursday, a day after the National Bank of Poland Monetary Policy Council decreased Poland's interest rates by 25 basis points, bringing the reference rate to 5.75%. This move comes after a sudden cut of 75 basic points in September. The 25-point cut was predicted by most economists. According to Statistics Poland, the country CPI inflation was 8.2% in September, reducing from 10.1% in August. Lapinski stated his preference for gradual interest rate adjustment over significant action. We prefer small changes over sudden ones, keeping consumers, bank and business sentiments in mind, Lapinski stated. Inflation currently states at 8.2% and over the next month it will be 7% percent plus an addition, he stated. By the year end, it should go down between 6 to 7 percent, and it will further reduce to 5 percent by middle of next year. Some experts predict a 4 percent inflation rate by fourth quarter 2024. Poland's inflation is anticipated to drop considerably in the forthcoming quarters, he added. He explained that the bank's 2.5 percent CPI objective could be accomplished because of cost and demand pressures. We will strive to attain this goal by 2020. He said. Despite sluggish economic activity, Lapinski expects marginal GDP growth in 2023. This year, the GDP of Poland is expected to grow slightly, but only by a small amount. The bank broke down CPI from 18.2% in February to 8.2% in September, as global inflation caused by external factors has subsided, according to Lapinski. We are rapidly approaching the situation of increasing inflation in Poland, as we have recently moved away from high high levels of inflation, stated Glapinski. He disregarded the assertions of several economists who claimed that the lower fuel prices in Poland compared to other surrounding countries contributed to the low inflation readings seen in September. The initial decrease of 75 percent points in September, said Glapinski, was important. However, we prefer making regular small changes instead of one larger modification. He added that the decisions about future interest rate decreases depends on external factors. If we notice a fall in inflation within the next four to five quarters, it will be evident that this is happening. If the drop is gradual, the same conclusion will also be clear, stated Glapinski. The governor of the central bank was also questioned about the state of Polish Zloty, which weakened significantly following the 75 basic points rate in reduction in September. We are pleased when the Polish Zloty is strong because it combats inflation. However, we don't take any action to increase the exchange rate, since doing so would go against our belief in a free exchange rate, said Glapinski. He also stated that the central bank is content with the current exchange rate. Glapinski refused to confirm whether the central bank interfered on the foreign exchange market, but assured that there were no significant issues that require urgent attention.